So we found this place a couple years ago and we were extremely satisfied with the service and how accessible it is to get to. Um, this is our second time to stay here and we love it here. And the host, um, her name is Pauline. She is very accommodating and understanding when we checked in super late at night as we were stuck in traffic in Vancouver. So this is a common area where everyone can hang out or chill or you know meet new people like if they're staying at the same time but when we were there um, we didn't see anybody so we kind of have the place exclusively to ourselves which is very nice. The location is pretty close to downtown Hope. It has an amazing views of the mountains. The place is so clean however at night you might hear multiple trains going by and we were so tired that day anyway so it didn't bother us as much. And this is a big kitchen as you can see it's pretty spacious. I'm not quite sure if you can cook there. Um, when we checked in we just had our takeout with us so we weren't hungry at night so maybe you can ask Pauline about it. Oh just look at this so gorgeous up there. So if you're interested to come check out this place, um, call these numbers and you will receive a 5% discount or send them an email. I'm just going to put it right here on this link. So we booked the bare room with the adjoining room for the boys and we just shared the bathroom. Um, this room includes free hot or continental breakfast. Uh, we have a private deck queen bed, AC, there's bathrobes and slippers available, and there's tea and coffee uh, in the room as well. There's Wi-Fi and a satellite TV. So according to their website, they have high season rentals, which is running from May to October 15th, and that's $150 per night, and low season, which is running from October 16th to April 30th, it's $135 per night. It's pretty affordable, and so yeah, come check out this please it's super clean and you'll love it here Yeah? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you told me that. <laughs> Maybe not anymore. Yeah. Look at this. <laughs>
this is like the town itself of like historic like history like old yeah one of the old towns old, old towns hunting bigfoot and we found him it's right here oh i don't know it's a sasquatch <laughs> Just holding a traffic. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha